Hi, welcome again. My name is Dimitri and I'm an engineer at BFlash. In this video, we will explain how to analyze a log previously made by BLog function at BFlash. We start by opening a data log file that we have saved from a previous test, in this case, a Renault Megane 3 RS. Right away, you will see an overview of all log parameters in that specific test, like for example, boost pressure, mass airflow and load as well as their minimum and maximum values on the right. In the M850i video, I spoke about timing. Well, here you can see that the moment you press the start button, it doesn't really matter as you can change your x-axis later on. We're only interested in the red accentuated line, so we can use the bottom selector bar to select the range we want to investigate. As we have a lot of data available, we made the possibility to divide data into two charts. You can play around a bit and see what works best for you. There is also the possibility to hide specific data that you don't want to use by just clicking the hide button. In this example, we will use engine speed as our reference x-axis. Click proceed. You can see that signals are grouped by unit. The unit is displayed on the axis. The idea of the adjustable x-axis is that, for example, you can compare your dyno plot versus your log data and fine-tune the car accordingly. Switch to the second chart. You will see the button change direction. Let's move to the analysis mode. It will show you the real data according to the cursor location. You can deactivate the analysis mode by pressing the A button again. If the auto scaling function is not how you like it, you can always customize the Y axis for each signal. For example, engine torque we scale up to 400 newton meters and we change the minimum ignition timing from minus 15 to minus 10. You can keep fine tuning until you're 100% satisfied. Thanks for watching and good luck making that bespoke tune you've ever dreamed of. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. If you want to see more videos, check out our website or social media channels.